Well, after a drunken mayor signing city contracts, the guy elected to be the new mayor getting arrested for blackmailing his opponent with a lap dance tape. This morning, we know who is set to lead Sunland Park. Yeah, but you know what? There is still a lot of controversy down there. Our News 13's David Romero has the details. David, not everyone happy with this new mayor pick. Well, Elizabeth, many of the people last night were protesting for candidates who were potentially eligible and for those who couldn't even get into the meeting. Now, the Sunland Park saga is far from over, despite the council voting 3-2 to two in favor of Javier Perea to be their new mayor. A number of citizens who gave public comment pointed their fingers at the council in outrage after members voted 4-2 to two against appointing Gerardo Hernandez as the mayor. Hernandez was the man who lost to Daniel Salinas in the general election. He was also the man who Salinas is accused of blackmailing in a video with a stripper. Now, the room was so packed, potential candidates like Jesse Grajeda say they never got the chance to make their bid for the seat. I started seeing that people wanted some change, people wanted somebody different. Now, Mayor Elect Perea says he sympathizes with those who couldn't get into the meeting, but it was a first come, first serve basis. He also says one of his first goals as mayor is to look at the backgrounds of city employees, making sure nepotism and favoritism are not playing a role in Sunland Park government. Elizabeth, back to you.